we got a metal bird flying around. At times we get some droids, the little floating devices around here spying on us, trying to get the best hair tips in the world, but not gonna happen, folks. Not gonna happen. I was almost on my way to run out the door and head over to the flea market. And I was like, Sonny, you got plenty of stuff. You could list what you have here. Finish up the denim shorts, the pants, those other things, and then get some more stuff listed and then start getting stuff ready for the knickknacks auction. You are correct, subconscious Sonny. And now I'm here just chilling. It's really nice to sit outside at times. Although, although I'm sitting on this chair, which is little rinkety dink chairs. It happens to be my favorite chair. We have these beautiful yard furnitures and we only use them when family and friends come over. When I take off the covers, I don't like putting them back. I like to just have it in a way that's like, I'm gonna come back out later. But my wife, if she sees that I don't use it too often, she'd be like, you need to put the covers on. But I don't wanna, I don't wanna put them back on. I do it anyways. I know that when Carla wakes up, she's gonna say, you wanna go to the gym? And I haven't gone in, well, this would be two days if I don't go today. I've been doing pretty good. My tummy is feeling like it's a little flatter, although it's not, <laughs> but it's gonna be. <laughs> Where's my coffee? <laughs> it's gonna be a good day. I just, I already know it's gonna be a good day. So I think my neighbors have a balloon or something back there um, that's being blown up, like a jump house. And Tip's like, what is that? Where are the kids at? I wanna play with the kids. He loves kids. He would be all over him, uh, but he, he's gotten better. Oh. Hi, boy, come here. Let me show, let me give you a hug. What? Oh, 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 you're wet. It's sprinkling outside. You wanna say hello? You wanna say hello? Are you hungry? Oh, are you hungry? Are you hungry? Oh, what is that? What is that? What's, what's that? What's that? <laughs> He's like, what's going on? All right, so I got a feed tip. I'm gonna get this stuff knocked out and I'll be right back. All right, 9.33, time to get these up and listed. Did I drop anything? I did drop something. It's always that one little thing, that one little or one. Always trying to make it difficult on the man. All right, let's knock this out. Let's do this. I just got some, ooh, it's raining. Looks gloomy out there. Kinda like it though. I, oh, it's even louder out here. I got good news. Let's go back inside. Wow, did y'all see the color on my face just then? It's kind of like a Mexican twilight moment where the sun hits you and you glisten, but I was like red, like Hellboy. Which is kind of cool. Love that character. Good news, folks. Good news. I just checked on the status of the Kristen Louboutin red bottom sneakers and it did get approved. It got approved. So here's a screenshot of what I've seen. I was, I had confidence in it based off of what I've researched on it, looking at photos and then sharing photos that people don't share to make it even better for the person or people looking at it. Because I had like 15 or 14 watchers on it. But now... Will the person receive it and say, hey, I like these. Are they too dingy because they were and I did mark that and I said it in the description. Let's see what happens. So it's not done yet. It's not done yet. Hopefully they get them and leave a positive review right away. Because if that's the case, then I get to get that monies and put it over, over into savings. Which reminds me, I need to go drop off the orders here. I also get commission work for graphic designs, which I don't talk too much about because when I do, people tend to ask me, will you do graphic designs for me? And there is one person recently that asked. I just don't do it all the time because then I get overwhelmed with how much things people want. And when you're doing a design for somebody, doing custom work could take a lot of time, which is why I charge what I charge. But if it's for a good cause, I don't charge because I do it for the calls to give back. So I think Carla's up. Head over to the post office and drop off to two orders. Which one of them, the bucket hat, if I didn't tell you yet, the bucket hat is an actual international sale. So that ended up costing the buyer 
around $38 in total. So that $18 that wasn't at my 20 or 21 or more dollar um, price that I wanted, I'm fine with that because shipping overseas and internationally and to Canada can be really expensive. So in cases like that, I don't get bummed about it. I'm actually happy because there's things other people from other places are looking for and are shopping from me, which I've had quite a bit of overseas international shopping, especially to Canada on eBay, on knickknacks, and on whatnot. Good morning again, boy. You have another beautiful power nap? Are you gonna come down? <laughs> You're so fast. Carla is up. And I was like, you wanna go to the gym? And she's like, eh, right now. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, right now. <laughs> Cause she does sound like that for us. No, she doesn't. So she's like, I don't want to go to the gym. I'm hungry. Aren't you hungry? And I'm like, girl, I am always hungry. He always rubs his face right here, like particularly in that area. Like, told you. It's just one of his favorite spots. He would just play there by himself and rub his body, get a little rub, rubby dubbies. You're relaxing. He already ate. I haven't ate. I had coffee. I am energized. I am ready to go. And Carla wants to go eat out. So I'm waiting for her to get ready, drop off the orders, go have some a late lunch, and then more coffee? <laughs> Maybe. I'm not done listing the pants. Don't be upset, but be very happy with what I'm going to tell you right now. The Nike Performance pants, they've gone up in value twofold. They are now worth more than around $20. Those gray pants have sold recently for around $45, $48. There's some lighter gray ones that have sold for the same value, $35 up to $40, $45. And then the 501 jeans, even with the distressing, there was a similar one that sold for around $45. So the value of things are always changing, especially during the different time of the year. The influencers that are out and about uh, social media and saying these jeans are the best or this or that or a memory that kicks in by a movie that somebody watched and they're like, wait, I remember these exact jeans. Where do I find them? Let me go look on eBay. All right, folks, post office. Let's drop this stuff off. All right, I'm going to take you along to one of our favorite spots called Ramen Sora in Chinatown after we drop these off. Slip. All right. There's one. And these things are always so loud. All right. We're here at one of my favorite places with the love of my life. Yes, the love of my life. I don't know if I'm the love of her life, but <laughs> we're at one of our favorite places i fell in love with ramen noodles ever since i got stationed out in korea and this right here has been our go-to spot ever since we moved and found out about this place years ago oh also i just got a really low ball offer on the levi silver tab shorts that i just listed it's been less than an hour for 15 dollars i'm gonna i'm gonna ignore it for now It's starting to rain even more. All right, this place is a must, a must. Top of the list for coffees and sweetness. When this place first opened up, I like to brag that we bought one of everything. I don't know if I could afford to do that again anytime soon, but stuff is good. Sold out. I wonder if those are available though. Those are good. I'll eat those curl ones. I really wanted the thing we always come for is unfortunately so now. They're beignets. These are better than the ones in Louisiana. Don't hate me for that. You gotta try these yourself. 
Cocoa chip. Ooh, that looks good. Which cookie is sold out on the air rack? We ended up getting an Ubi Vietnamese coffee. This was the first time having Ubi with this. The Vietnamese coffees are pretty strong. And then here we have an array of sweetness. Can't wait to try them, but I have a live to go on to. I'm done. I'm going to stuff my face with a couple of these, sip on some of this coffee, share with Carla, and then hop over on my main channel because I'm about to go live if I make it in time at five. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. Yeah. One day she'll get on YouTube. One day.